We're going to explain how to enable Dolby Atmos in VLC Media Player. Unfortunately, there's no built-in Dolby Atmos support in VLC. VLC is primarily a decoder, not an encoder or sound processor. It plays what the audio file gives it. To get Dolby Atmos, the source file itself must contain Dolby Atmos audio, and your system needs the correct hardware and drivers to decode and output it. Let's break down what you need to check. 1. Check your audio file. Does your movie or music file actually contain Dolby Atmos? The file name or metadata should indicate this. If it's a standard stereo or 5.1 surround sound file, VLC won't magically turn it into Atmos. 2. Ensure your system supports Dolby Atmos. You need a compatible sound card receiver or soundbar with Dolby Atmos decoding capabilities. Windows generally handles the decoding through its audio drivers. Check your sound device settings in Windows Sound Control Panel or your receiver settings to confirm Atmos support. 3. Correct audio output device. Make sure VLC is set to output audio to the correct device in your system. In VLC, go to Tools Preferences Audio. Under Output Module, select the appropriate output device that supports Dolby Atmos. This might be a specific HDMI output, your sound card, or an integrated audio chip on your motherboard. 4. Verify your audio drivers. Outdated or corrupted audio drivers can prevent Atmos from working correctly. Go to your computer manufacturer's website or the sound card manufacturer's website to download and install the latest drivers for your audio device. 5. Output Mode Within VLC's audio settings, look for any options related to the audio output mode. While there isn't a direct Dolby Atmos selection, ensure that the chosen mode isn't limiting your audio to a lower format, like stereo. Experiment with different output modules if necessary. Remember, the success of hearing Dolby Atmos depends entirely on having an Atmos encoded source file and a compatible system capable of decoding and playing it back. VLC's role is simply to play the audio. It doesn't transform audio formats. If you've checked all of these points and still aren't getting Atmos, it might indicate an issue with your hardware setup or the audio file itself. Try testing with different Atmos encoded content and checking your system's audio configuration thoroughly.